No winter weather today, just cold as we work through your Wednesday. Beautiful luck. look as the sun is coming up over the hills of Rensselaer County. Live view there, of course, over the campus of Siena College. We should enjoy a good deal of sunshine to go along with that chill that is not going anywhere over the next several days. Temperatures not quite as cold as they were yesterday. We're sitting at 20 in Albany, but factor in the wind. Wind chills are in the teens, even some single digits right now. As we work through the day, the breeze is going to hang with us, certainly adding to that brisk feel. Temperatures in the low 30s this afternoon. We'll start to see some clouds building in and that is associated with the winter storm that will really kick into high gear as it will work through the afternoon and evening hours of Thursday. We're going to speed ahead to tomorrow morning, waking up with high pressure over the capital region, so still all dry. But here comes that wintry weather starting to build in from the south and west as we go through the late afternoon and evening hours. Thursday, the Catskills will be the first to be impacted. I think as we get closer to the evening commute, that's when the capital region will come into better view. Rather quickly, things become widespread. What is going to be interesting is the temperature in elevation. Isn't that always the case across uh, this part of the country, though? Uh, we do have colder air that's rushing in from the north, so that's why we're going to keep things all snow into the hills and the higher elevations. It's what's coming up off of the ocean, that milder air that will be adding to that wintry mix setup, especially into the Hudson Valley as we go into Friday. So things still look to be a little messy with this nor'easter that will continue to run up the coast rather slowly, keeping that mixed bag going again, mainly into the valleys. Meanwhile, for the higher terrain, it will be a more high impact winter event with some heavy snow. That's why winter storm watch has been posted by the National Weather Service. You notice it's not for everyone. It's the high terrain, the Mohawk Valley. That's where we are uh, expecting higher confidence and bigger impacts from that heavy snow. And the snow map is going to be eleva elevation dependent, and we could see widely varying amounts over just a short distance again because of elevation. Top spots into the Adirondacks, the Catskills, even the Southern Green Mountains could easily pick up over a foot of snow as we work towards the valley floor closer to Albany, two to five inches of snow. And again, the rain comes into play that may cut down on some of those totals. So still, we need to work out the transition from snow over to rain for the valley uh, valleys, and that will determine then how much snow we actually end up with. So still some questions there. Brisk, a little breezy today, though. That's no question. High of 33 under filtered sunshine. More clouds will arrive overnight, but still temperatures will be cold back down into the teens to near 20. All dry during the day. This winter storm kicks off. Thursday evening will last into Friday. That beginning part is really where we're going to feel the greatest impact from the storm. We'll wrap things up with scattered snow showers on Saturday. Sunday should be all quiet. We'll keep it that way into the start of next week, but that cold air not going into anywhere as we draw closer to the first day of winter one week from today. Thank you, Jill. Six